Hey guys, Nicholas Marston here, and I bet you just found out the great news of Walking Dead being on Vita. And you don't know if it's a good investment or not. Well then, I am here to help. I know, I know, such a people's person. Man, I'm great. <laughs> I've spent a decent amount of time into the game and figured out all you need to know to see if it's a good purchase or not. Now this review will be slightly different than the others because the game is simply a port and I'm only reviewing the transition to Vita and not the game itself. Wait, what? Some of you don't even know what The Walking Dead is? <gasps> okay, okay, quick, quick, cue the recap. Alright, so The Walking Dead is a choice set adventure game by Telltale Studios. The whole game is decision based which means you can choose different paths and ways to complete the game. For example, you might save a person and I might let that person die. Or you can alter relationships by being nice or mean to this person. This is what makes the Walking Dead experience so special. You and I are tasked with the same goal of protecting yourself, but the way we do it might be completely different from you and I. I might choose to befriend someone you hate and you might choose to leave someone I took. Now the game cast us as Lee Everett, a convicted murderer on the way to the big house. However, before Mr. Everett can churn in his denim shirt for an orange jumpsuit, the zombie apocalypse breaks out and gives Lee a new goal in life, namely surviving at all costs and protecting a little girl named Clementine. The game has an excellent writing from the Telltale staff that manages to be funny, scary, tense, all at the right moments. There's amazing voice acting from Lee and Clementine and a visual style that's pulled from the comic book world that never manages to be boring. The Walking Dead the game is something special by giving players the option to craft relationships and make choices that fill out the story. The Walking Dead wraps you up in its events and makes you care in a way few games can. Sure the game is great, but how does the game hold up on the PlayStation Vita? Well, so far the 2.3 GB game is awesome. I can say the game is 100% better than the iOS counterpart, adding touch and button based movements. It's $5 cheaper than consoles and $10 cheaper than iOS. You can get PlayStation trophies as well as an easy to get platinum. You can start wherever in the game you want, just in case you want to resume from another device. There's not that much frame dropping as in iOS, and as a bonus, it looks better. Quite frankly, just the overall feel of the game is superb and I have no complaints on the porting of the game. In fact, I can say that this is the best version of this game yet. Now if you've played the game already on another device, I won't say to go run and buy it. It's a great game, if you want it again then be my guest. But if you haven't got this game yet, then what the hell's wrong with you boy? Go get that damn game! This is the best version of the game you can get! So, Walking Dead equals thumbs up. My name is Nicholas Marston here and... Peace out.